Hey y'all, uh, hey, it's Reese. Welcome back for a quick little video. First, let me say thank you to all of my old subscribers and welcome to all of my new subscribers. New subscribers, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you will know every single time I what? Upload a new video. So with that being said, we are going to go ahead and jump right into this video. So today, you are going to be graced with me talking about Liv's life. All right, so I already know y'all heard about it. I already know y'all seen the video. Okay, so Liv, you did this whole play. I'm not going to say skit. I'm going to say you did this whole play. And you came on and you know you were in your little soft voice that you do when you say, um, because you guys are my friend and there is, you know, some things that I would like to um, address with you and also some things that I will be going through. Okay, so you did all of that. You came on, you even cried and everything. You said, well, you were getting the surgery and you said that, um, you were not doing it for someone. You were not doing it for any of the trolls. You were doing it for you to make yourself more happy. Okay. So, remember, remember when Passion Jones was getting hers? And I said this time and time before. And after she got it, you actually had a confrontation with her about getting a surgery for her body to make her healthy, okay? So anyway, you said that you didn't want to go ahead and you didn't want to step on a plus size community and all that type of stuff. But I'm going to be honest with you because, you know, I'm plus size or whatever. I'm a fat ass. That's what they call me and I sit on the side of my bed. Okay. Oh, let me tell y'all this too. If you don't like reaction videos, I think the best thing for you to do at this point is go ahead and click off my video, okay? So you don't have to be in the comments, you know what I mean? Getting carpal tunnel, you know, getting really upset, hyperventilating and stuff like that while you're typing me a message. Girl, just go ahead and do that. I just think that would be much, much easier. So back to you, Liv. So yeah, you came on here with a whole entire play. And I'm looking at the screen, the screen looking back at me. I'm looking at the screen. I'm like this girl. So you go on to say basically that you are going to get the weight surgery. All right. So after a while, I noticed that you were drinking like the protein shakes and stuff like that. And we're going to go back to that, but keep that in mind. So you said you were going to get VSG surgery. Now, from my point, I feel like if you want to get surgery, that's your body. I don't have to carry around, you know what I'm saying, the weight that you carry around. See, a lot of people don't get it that, you know, people are made differently, okay? Just like a lot of people tell me that I'm fat or whatever, but the thing is, I am tall, okay? So my weight and my body structure looks different than, you know, someone else with the same weight, okay? Um, yeah, I have a lot of hips, um, I have a lot of bottom, um, and it is what it is. It's just for some reason on camera, my arms seem to look extra big, but you know what? I think they are big. Yeah, they big. Anyway, I mean, whatever. Um, when people talk about my weight or when people talk about me or whatever, it, I'm kind of one of those ones, it don't really bother me because you're not paying any of my bills, you know what I mean? You're not paying for any of my clothes, you know what I mean? I, so, it, it really don't even bother me. But anyway, yeah, so you, you went on to say that you were going to go and get the surgery. Basically, you said in so many ways that um, you were going out of the state to get the surgery. Okay, but I had already knew and I talked about it in previous videos because like I said, my son father had to have the same surgery. So I knew every single thing that went with it. And it was a lot of things that you know you were not even mentioning and you would have been mentioning when you made that VSG um, thing that you said you were going to get. 
And like I said, I'm like, you have to take um, psychology um, classes. You got to do that. You got to actually have your doctor write you a letter of support. You have to, I mean, it is a lot of things that go with that surgery. And you wasn't, you know, dishing us out any type of information. So that's why I'm like, wait a minute. This girl, if she's not, wait a minute. So I'm like, wait a minute. If this girl is not dishing us out any type of information, telling us, you know, what she's going through, your only thing you're basically saying is, I'm going to go and get this fat off me. Okay. I knew that you had to be basically going out of the country to have this done. Okay. And when you said it, um, I have to be honest, and I said it in my other videos, um, I would not go out of the country and have this type of surgery done. I don't care if Molly and your next door neighbor, your church friend, you know what I mean, your YouTube friend, they went and did that. That's on them. Because you never know what is going to happen to you. You get what I'm saying? Um, like I said before, I had a friend that was on YouTube and they were a really, really big YouTuber. Okay. And she went out of country to the DR to have this surgery done. And after I would say maybe a year, she started to have a lot of complications. And she passed away from it. Okay. And like I said before in that video, um, when she went, the doctor did not even speak a lick of English. The doctor would always come in with someone, I guess a nurse, an assistant, a tech or whatever you want to call it. And they would translate what he was saying to her. Okay. Um, yeah. So, I mean, I, I just wouldn't do it, but, um, I really well, what I think, too, is that I always felt as though that you would go and get the surgery. I felt that way, too. But what really got me was when I started to see you drink the protein drinks. And like I said, when you get this surgery, you have to eat the pro you have to eat the protein bars, protein drinks, B12, all types of medications that you have to take afterwards. So I've never really seen any other videos where you decided to be like, oh, okay, I'm gonna be healthy and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna drink eat um I'm gonna drink pr protein shakes. I'm I, you know, I'm gonna do it. So when I actually started seeing you to seeing you drink the actual protein shakes, I was like, hmm. So that kind of leads me to believe, Liv, that you are getting ready to come up with a whole nother skit. You are getting ready to probably be on your best bullshit. And I know y'all already know I'm a fool, but look. That's how I am. I really think that you are getting ready to be on your best bullshit. And I'm going to tell you why right now. So, something, a little birdie inside me. I mean, I don't. I may be wrong, but I'm going to just put it out there. I kind of feel like what you have already done is went and got the surgery already. That's what... You know, the, the people on the side of my shoulders is telling me, okay? And, you know, I'm, I'm listening, okay? I feel like what you're going to do is you're going to keep doing what you're supposed to do. You're going to keep losing the weight. And then you're going to come up here on here and you're going to be like, yeah, y'all. You know, I've been eating right. You know, I've been working out right. You know, I took like all of the drama out of my life. I mean, me and Gerard are good. The kids are good. I started back talking to my dad. My sister, we're in a great place. I feel like you're going to come to the whole front with this. Okay, I, I feel like it. And you're going to be like, yeah, I, you know, I did it. I finally got the weight off with exercising. Liv, you better not do that bullshit. If you'd have had that surgery, we already going to know, okay? Because you stopped dropping pounds and pounds and pounds and pounds. 
You get what I'm saying? Then on top of that, your stomach, that's going to be, you know, it's, it's going to be, y'all know, it's just going to be like, you know, dead, like, you, yeah. So, I kind of feel like that. Because, I mean, you always, I'm trying to tell you, Liv, you always got something up your sleeve, okay? And, you know, Reese always can, like, see through the bullshit. But if that is what you did, and you know what I mean, you did it because you did it for your health, then hey, I don't have anything bad to say about that at all, okay? But let's get on talk about this where you said the other day you um, posted a video, and you said that you're basically just in a good place, and you are trying to retract all the drama that is in your channel, okay? So let me tell you this, Liv. If ain't nobody else tell you, I'm going to tell you right away. It's no way that you can retract the drama that is in your channel. You know why? Because your channel and your subscribers started to prosper when you got in the drama that you got in with Strong Mommy Chrissy. I mean, it is what it is. And if it was me, I don't have no problem with telling the truth. I, I would say, yep, soon as I got in a drama with her, my views went up. My time that people was watching my videos and my subscribers, they skyrocketed. Thank you, tr thank you, Chrissy. Yep, thank you. But no, you always come on here and you're always like, no. I started like taking off, you know, really fast and then, the, and no. You are like, come on now, live. Just like if you try and get the drama out, which is not going to happen, like I said, you're always going to continue to have drama because you're a drama channel. So when you do take that drama out, do you think that your subscribers are going to be coming over there to see, you know what I mean? It's cute, your daughter painting your nails and doing your makeup. I mean, that's cute. Uh, do you think they're going to be coming over there to watch you cook? Cause, but you can't cook, so that's not going to be a good um, fit for you. Um, do you think that somebody's going to be coming over there to watch you, to bag up, um, you know, your little butterflies? What is it? The little flash? Yeah, the flash butterflies. I mean, yeah, anyway. Yeah, do you think somebody is going to... See these people. Do you think that they are going to come over to your channel and be like, oh, let me go spend about 30 minutes over there with Liv so I can watch her box up, you know, her eyelashes and everything. Let me go ahead over there so I can see her do a clean with me video. Let me go over there so I can see what other fucked up shit Gerard did this month, this week, today. And it is what it is. I mean, even on my channel, people come over here because they want me to, they want to see the reviews. You get what I'm saying? Um, they want to see me talk about different things. Um, people have always came over here to watch me cook. Um, see, with my channel, it's a lot of things that I can do. They could watch me cook. Like I said, I am a full-time reseller. So that's something that I don't never bring on camera when on the weekends that's why i don't actually do videos on saturday and sunday and the reasoning behind that is because friday saturday and sunday they are my most busiest days okay um so yeah that is why i am able to sit my fat ass on this bed and you know what I'm saying? Do what I do and come on here as flawless as I can come on here. Yeah. Yeah. So, Liv, you're not the only one, you know what I mean, that own a, a business. So, just throwing that out there because I know a lot of you guys want to know exactly what I do, how I do it, and when I do it. But let me get something clear with you guys. You guys are going to know what I want you to know. What I do not want you to know you will never, ever know. See, I open up myself to you little by little. You get what I'm saying? Little by little. And even with that said, there are things that I, I will not personally show. But yeah, I let you see exactly what I want you to see, how I want you to see it, and when I want you to see it. 
So a lot of people, you know, they want me to do a home tour um, because I only sit on this side of the bed. But let me get y'all together and I'm going to get y'all together this last time. I don't vlog my life. What I do is reactions. That's what you come over here for, to see a reaction. And like I said before, if you don't like reactions, then you can go ahead and click off. I just don't be understanding why that is so hard. So when I come on here, I'm not going around my house to show you my whole entire house. I'm not doing anything of that because that is not how I started my channel, okay? Now, with all of that being said, I am going to go ahead and end this video. Thank you to all of my old subscribers and welcome to all of my new subscribers. New subscribers, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you will know what every single time that I come through with a new video. So until my next video guys, see you later.